Hi everyone! Recently, I've uploaded two videos about our three days to a night's Baguio trip. And in this video, I'm going to show you how I packed minimally for me, my husband, and our toddler using only one duffel bag. It is a three days, two nights trip, so here are all the clothes and toiletries and my makeup kit that we're going to pack. So here's the duffel bag that we are going to use for our trip. It is an antler bag that I bought in Adelaide last year. It's, I think it's a regular size bag that's mostly used for carry-on. Um, what I love about this bag is that it's very light and it can fit a lot of stuff. So here's there's a compartment for the shoes and lots of small pockets inside and outside too. I would also like to mention that apart from this duffel bag, I'm also going to use a backpack for when we go out of the hotel so I don't have to bring this duffel bag everywhere. Let's get into packing. So first one, here are the packing cubes I'm using. This one is a souvenir from Chevron. It's a small bag. And this one, I bought this from Japan Home. I think it's it cost only 88 pesos. It's a regular size packing cube. And this one is just a regular laundry bag from Miniso because I only have two packing cubes. This will work. <laughs> First off, I'm going to pack my son's clothes. So this is a three days worth of clothes. Just shirts, pants, PJs, socks. And since there's still space, I've included some of these towels and a bath towel too. Then, I just noticed that my son's clothes can fit into the smaller packing cube. So in here, I'm just going to transfer all of what I've packed earlier to the smaller packing cube. And yep! It fits. Moving on, I'm now packing my clothes using the packing cube I've used earlier. And let's see if it will fit. You might also notice that the folding method I use is very similar if not the same with the KonMari method. And the last pieces, I'm going to include my reusable panty liners.
and yes it fits and now I'm packing my husband's clothes using this laundry bag judging by its look it looks like that this will not fit but I assure you it will I've tried this many times I've used this method when I went to Australia for a week and yes of course it will fit Using packing cubes or even laundry bags are very efficient when you're traveling. As you can see in this one, um, it's very organized and you will not have trouble finding your clothes. You will also notice that I can probably fit another shirt in here because there's still a space for it. So here's what I call our toiletry pouch. Um, I also call this my liquid pouch when I'm traveling abroad. So in here, I just included my, um, my sunscreen and this one, my moisturizer. It's just a virgin coconut oil, Lucas Pepao ointment, and Zane's body wash in a small container. Um, this one, it's our black toothpaste. I love this one. It's a zero waste alternative to conventional toothpaste. Some cotton pad, cotton balls, I mean. My toothbrush, and I forgot to include in here the toothbrushes of my husband and my kid, but I included it. Hand cream. Um, and in this one, just, just a container for my earrings. Or some jewelries. And in this one, it's just where I put my supplements, vitamins. And here's a spare comb and a band aid. And in this one, this one, I, this is probably my favorite. It's just a tin can, but when you open it, you will see that there are three kinds of bar. The first one is the our body soap. My husband and I use this and then this one is a shampoo bar and this one is my facial wash so you can see um, it's very efficient that I have included all in here this method of minimalistic packing is very life-changing because before I used to carry a lot of stuff now I have all my toiletries in here and I would also like to show you how I transfer small amounts of liquids into small containers like this this one I bought from Miniso so I just put small amounts that I need for three days for this is Zane soap and that's it Next is my makeup kit. So I don't wear a lot of makeup. I don't use foundation or powder. So these are just facial cream, concealer, eyebrow, some chapstick, mascara. So that's all. And now, fitting everything into the duffel bag. Do you think it will all fit? Well, of course it did. I'm just going to show you how I organize it inside plus also um, I've included some diapers and my camera bag too
You may now realize that packing cubes are really a lifesaver when it comes to traveling. As you can see in this, it's very organized. So it, your things will not mix up with other clothes or other stuff and you can easily find it. And also, the use of small containers are very efficient too. So you may also try that one if you haven't tried yet because it will save you a lot of space and it will save you from mental clutter. Before I became a minimalist, I used to overpack. I pack lots of clothes, stuff, especially emergency clothes that most of the time I don't use. So I thought that maybe next time I shouldn't be bringing some emergency clothes because most of the time, if I really need some extra clothes, I can purchase it from where I am at the moment. Yes, it fits. So in this, I'm just going to fix the sides because I don't need that extra space anymore. And here it is. One duffel bag for a family of three for a three days, two nights trip. I hope you learned something from this video and if you haven't yet, you can also try this method for when you pack for your next travel. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!